he's lucky it's a Saturday morning and he'd have probably been squished already. This is Log Truck Central. Which way are you going, buddy? Let's get you across. Why are you just standing there, man? Little dude just sitting there like, nah, this is where I belong. Nah, go on, man. If you go back out in that road, man. I hate seeing a squished turtle. We are out here on the sawdust shoveler. You can call it the duster for short. Just getting out of work. We're gonna go for a little rip. This one's dedicated to all my working builders. The ones who grind the hard shifts so they can enjoy a little bit of freedom. There you go guys, there's a nice little price check for you, $100 frame, $100 motor, well it was back when I bought it, <laughs> it ain't $100 no more, nothing but a well ported cylinder, and some holes drilled in the exhaust cap, that's it, and she pulls my 200 pound ass great, so, for all my OGs, anyone who's struggling on a tight budget, yeah, you ain't gotta you ain't gotta worry about nothing holding you back. G4 China Dolls are still by far my favorite motorized bikes to work on. The performance stuff is fun, and it's great to rip that throttle and feel that power. But I will always come back to these because of their price, their ease to modify, and the amount of performance you can get out of them when you do a good modification. Now listen to that idle. She will sit there and idle that tank drive. That's my kind of bike. <laughs> 